This is Dabu7. Some space updates here. In case you missed the live streams, I want to make sure that people are aware of what's going on with this comet Atlas. It is breaking apart, fragmenting. This is exactly what I was talking about in the last video. This is part of a family of fragmenters, so to speak. A larger comet a long time ago that was breaking into pieces. This is said to continue to do the same thing. So it, it looks like Atlas falling apart is not going to put on the show that many people were hoping for. But it has been replaced with the brand new one they've discovered here, C-2020 F8, or also known as Comet Swan. It is already at 8th magnitude in terms of brightness. And this one looks like it just may put on a show for us, coming out of nowhere. So as one fizzles out and disappears, they just so happen to discover another one coming in right behind it. This is a look at it right here. It obviously has a different time frame, a different course, and all of that. And we'll keep an eye on it. They just picked this thing up on April 11th. And this was found by the Soho Swan Instrument. That's why it gets the name right there. This is the 8th discovery credit for Swan since 2004. So it's green, it has a long tail, and there you go, there's a look at it right there. It's already got a long tail on it, so the closer it gets, the better this is going to be to see, and as it gets closer to the sun, it will develop its second tail, and if it's observable, I'll keep you guys posted and all that good stuff as time goes by, but a switch up here, we're eyeballing this one now. I will continue to update, make sure to follow us over here on DLive. Multiple live streams throughout the week, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, 9 p.m. Eastern. Eyes to the skies.